Janet, it's a $15,000 dog. This is not a pet you're going to find in the classifieds. So raising money is their top priority, and the biggest fundraiser is coming up. When we go out into public, um, he will very often just rip out of our hands and run. And sometimes Marius Eden runs into the middle of the road. He has absolutely no regard for safety. He does not understand that something is dangerous. So now his family is in the middle of raising $15,000 to buy an autism service dog. They've raised 6000 so far. His mother says the dog will save her son's life. In Marius's case, the dog will literally be trained to herd him like a sheepdog. So he will come between Marius and windows and push him away from windows or from doors because you cannot watch him 24-7. And really, if you want to keep him safe, that is what you have to do. They're trying to buy the dog from Wildwood Service Dog in Tennessee. Deirdre Eaton hopes the dog will help Marius socialize with other people and keep him safe. There's something so special about these kids with autism. It's like what they're lacking in other things, they make up in a way that they touch your life and your heart that just makes you a better person. And Maria certainly is that for us. That's a uh, South African accent, by the way, uh, from uh, Deirdre. Uh, the major fundraiser is Sunday, a golf tournament at Eagleville uh, Golf Club in Fairport, followed by a reception at Landing Bar and Grill. We have the times and the locations and the prices at WHEC.com right now. We also have a link to their online donation page for Marius. Now, the goal here, uh, Janet Rich, is to have $15,000 raised by the end of October. They already have 6000 if they can do it by the end of October, they might be able to have a dog for Marius up here working with him by March or April of next year. So they're having this fundraiser, but yeah. does insurance cover any of this? Zero. Mm. Zero. Which is a, a problem with a lot of families dealing with yes. uh, autism. So that's why they have to have these fundraisers. It all comes out of pocket. Um, and so our community probably will help them out. It's a very giving community. Hopefully yeah. they'll have a nice day for the uh, golf tournament. Berkeley, thanks very much.